guys so today I have a bunch of random products which I ordered online some of them are from Amazon and some of them are from some other websites so I finally got them some of these products you've already seen but I haven't really used them and the others have just come in so let's have a look at this and see if they're actually useful BAM! so here it is so I've already shown you guys this knife in the cooking video but I got a lot of you guys asking me to show you these so here it is and I'll talk about this in a minute and I showed you guys an unboxing of this I haven't really used it so I just put batteries in them so I got new batteries in them let's check out how this works and I have a funny problem basically you know on the windowsill so I have a lot of dead bugs for some reason the bugs blow in there and they just die I have no idea why they do that and we have a mosquito mesh so I don't want to be peeling the mosquito mesh off all the time and wiping it down you know because then you start getting these things falling inside so the solution to my problem is this yeah I don't use a cloth I use this so this isn't a vacuum cleaner it's the opposite actually it's it's a blower it's a leaf blower so I found this really cheap leaf blower on Amazon and I ordered it and it's come and let's check out if it actually works you know it's got a dust bag because I think it has a function of doing a bit of a vacuum as well but the primary function is to blow to blow dirt off so I'm gonna try it for the first time here on video with you guys that's the nozzle and let's see how this works it's supposed to be really powerful of course it's not the best this is just a cheap one but I'm really curious to see how this works so we'll come back to this so let's have a look at these knives so these knives come in a set of six six knives and six covers so Amazon marks this as a 12 piece set but it's actually just six knives and six covers so the basic concept here is this color coding you know so when you're cooking and prepping and stuff you basically don't mix up the knife so you don't use the meat knife for vegetables and contaminate it and vice versa and no these knives are not plastic a lot of people have been asking me if these knives were plastic but they're not plastic they're steel so these knives are actually all stainless steel and I don't know why I like doing this it just feels so nice putting it back into the case the protector and pulling it out I don't know I get a kick out of doing that and these knives are actually really sharp they are really sharp and in case they go blunt if you see it's got an edge which can be sharpened so all this is colored powder coated I guess and that sharp edge so you can sharpen it if it goes blunt so each of these knives have a specific purpose like this is the meat knife and that's another chef knife and this one's a bread knife I leave a detailed description of what each knife is uh, either in the video or in the description you guys can look that up and we've been using this one quite a lot you know this one's really good to do fruits and veggies and stuff this one's been really handy it's a nice size fits in the hand well so I quite like this set it's, it's really useful that's the orange one yeah I think this one's the chef knife and that's something else anyway I'll leave what each one of it is in the description like I said so that's each one of them and it kind of makes cooking fun you know I don't cook that much as you guys know but it's nice to see these vibrant colors and stuff it's really nice so that's what these knives are all about nice and colorful knives and another thing I want to show you guys is of course this isn't new we've been using this for quite some time now uh, this is also part of the Amazon basics range and these are these really nice scissors that they sell and why I like them is you know you can use them as scissors and you can use them as separate as like two blades makes it easy for cleaning and you can use each of these separately so you got like a jagged edge on this to help you with cutting and this one has an opener on this so you can use this to 
pop some beers and stuff and when you put them back together you get a nutcracker here so this has been really handy this isn't new but I'm showing you guys this because I think this is really useful so I'm gonna link all these things down in the description so you guys can go and check it out on Amazon and maybe get it for yourself so let's check out the other little gadget that I have and that's this back sealer so I got this the other day and I unboxed it and this side's a magnet so I basically unboxed it and put it on the fridge and I forgot about it I haven't really used it so I just put in some batteries into it today and I'm curious to see if this actually works so I think this is like a safety mechanism yeah that pops open and I have a half eaten bite of nachos yeah I ate some nachos so I could do this video otherwise I wouldn't have a bag of chips so let's pop one in mm, very good nachos so let's see if this thing works so I guess the basic concept is these elements heat up and seal the bag it seems to be doing something yeah oh my god that actually worked check this out guys this is awesome one of those one dollar two dollar items that I found on one of these sites um, you know like Alibaba so really handy I think we're going to be using this I'm quite impressed with this and yeah I think we're going to be using this actually nice let's put the safety back on and put this on the fridge so guys now it's time to check out if this leaf blower works you know and if it actually sorts what I'm trying to do so I've hooked it up. Let's see if it powers on. Wow, that's loud. Yeah, so that's how it sounds. Let's put it to use and see if it actually sorts my problem. And then I'm going to be proper happy. So guys, we have a bunch of leaves and some dead bugs and stuff here. So let's see if this actually works. Let's give this thing a go. that works so well I'm so happy with this I'm gonna have a lot of fun using this you know so life's too small to make things fun and this thing is fun so get yourself one of these guys it's a lot of fun so yeah I use this for a practical purpose to clean stuff uh, let's see what I can do with this like fun fun so do you remember guys these fidget spinners this was all the rage last year so let's try and make a uh, air powered fidget spinner let's see if this works it's check that out so that's like a air powered fidget spinner and it's just going and going and going yeah I'm gonna be up to a lot of mischief with this, that's for sure. <laughs> Check this out, it's still spinning. <laughs> so guys, that was a lot of fun, but <laughs> Charlie didn't enjoy that. I put his toy on the floor and it blew across the floor onto the other side of the room. And he's just looking at me stunned like, I don't like that. I think it's the noise that's bugging him. Of course, I didn't point the thing at him because it's quite powerful and he's just a baby. So. Speaking of Charlie, we got him a little outfit because if you guys know, his birthday is coming up soon and Charlie's going to be one quite soon, in like a bit over a month I think, yeah. So that package that you saw maybe in the start, this one, so this one's actually for Charlie. We haven't opened it yet, let me open it now on camera and it's basically a little 
birthday outfit for him. So the thing with Charlie is he doesn't really enjoy uh, these fancy clothes and costumes on him, obviously, because he gets really hot. So we found this little tux. I hope it's the right size. So this is what it is, guys. It's like a harness that's designed like a tux. So it's not a full-on body outfit that's going to heat him up, but I think he should be comfortable in this because it's just a little thing. I'm not going to put him in this and ruin the surprise of you guys seeing him on his birthday. So I will try that off camera and see that it actually fits him. And the tricky thing is when you buy uh, these outfits for your pet online, you need to measure their chest with a tape and compare it to what the sizing options are and then place an order. Then it should be fine. So this looks good. I'm quite happy with it. I hope Charlie is happy wearing it and I hope it fits him. You guys will see this on his birthday. I'm not going to spoil the surprise now. And I'm sure he's going to look super cute in it. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the stuff that I got. And if you like any of the cool stuff and want to get it yourself, then use my Amazon affiliate links. It's going to be in the description. So now I'm going to head out with Charlie and take him for a little walk. Let him get some fresh air and some running around and some exercise. So let's get him all harnessed up and I'll see you guys later. So guys, we're back home and it's actually quite late right now. We had a bit of a scare with Charlie tonight and uh, after he was done playing, Charlie came up to us and he was kind of frothing from his mouth. So that was like really scary for us. So we rushed him to his wet and basically it was something like uh, allergic reaction, probably got bitten by a bug or ate some rubbish, I don't know. So they gave him a little injection to stop that fraud thing and make him not react to the allergy. So he's fine now, he's just resting. But that was a big scare for Shahala and me. And we're just glad he's okay now. He's nice and calm and peaceful now. He's, he's all good. So uh, yeah, it's so late now. So I'm just going to wrap up here, go to bed. And I'll see you guys in another video. So peace, good night. See ya.